Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today's video is just a, another haul um, from Colourpop Cosmetics. This is the company right here. This is actually the um, inside cover of the box that I received my eyeshadows in. I thought this was really pretty so I decided to save it. So I'm just going to get right into the haul. Um, when I received my package, um, it came pretty fast. I mean, I live in Canada, so it takes normally around a week and a half to two weeks for me to receive anything that I get from the States. Um, now, ColourPop Cosmetics is a company, I believe they're based out of California. Um, they don't test on animals, um, and they mainly, their product of choice are cream to powder, eyeshadows now when I receive my package they do send you out a personalized um, note just to thank you for shopping with them and then at the back it just has their logo with a big thank you inside as well you do receive some information on their new lippy sticks and lippy pencils that they are now selling um, as well as tips and tricks on how to use their eyeshadows. Now with the eyeshadows, they are known as uh, their Super Shock shadows, which are like a cream to powder type of eyeshadow. Um, they call them party proof. Um, you don't experience any fallout. Um, they really, really last, like they last. They don't budge, they don't move. Um, they also give you tips and tricks on maximum, how to achieve maximum coverage, um, how to blend them and how to care for the eyeshadows themselves because they are cream to powder finish. So I'm just going to get right in. This is the packaging that the eyeshadows come in. Okay. So you get 0 0.6, 0 0.06 ounces of product, which um, weighs out to be about 1.8 grams of product. They have different finishes from pearlized to metallic to ultra metallic to matte finishes, I believe, from colors anywhere from pink to green to blue to yellows to oranges. So they really have a wide selection of colors for you to choose from. So for those of you that like more of the natural nude looks, they have colors to suit you. And for those that really, really like bold looks, um, which you'll see some of the shadows that I did pick up, they have some to suit your fancy as well. So they have their company logo right here on the cover of the eyeshadow. When using these and when you're finished, you have to really remember to close the cap tightly because they will dry out. So the first color that I want to show you today, this is in a metallic finish and um, it's the color is Shameless. So I'm just going to show you so that you could see. And that's the color there. It's like a burnt greenish black color. So I'm going to swatch at the back of my finger first for you to see. And then I'm going to swatch at the back of my hand. So that looks like that. So again, this is in the color Shameless. The next color that I have for you today is in the color Lace. Now Lace is a pearlized finish. And it's quite similar in to Shameless, except it's purple. It's a really, really deep purpley color. So that is lace on my middle finger. I'm going to swatch that on the back of my hand for you to see as well. So that's lace. The next color, which is my second favorite, I would say, this is in the color Mooning. And it also is a pearlized finish. And it looks like that. So swatched on the back of my hand, it looks like this. Or on my finger, sorry, the back of my hand. There you go. The next color, which I just had to do some surgery on because I actually had to re-record this video because I dropped it in the other one. This is in the color Bay, which is a metallic finish. It's also a duochrome. 
that's bay. I'm going to swatch it on the back of my finger for you to see. Looks like that. And on the back of my hand, that is bay. So the next colors, got to clean the back of my hand now and my finger. The next color that I'm going to show you is in fantasy. So this is fantasy. It doesn't say what type of finish this is. However, it does say it's not for the eye area. Um, reason being, it does stain the eye. I did experience staining when I used fantasy and slave to pink. When I woke up the neck after removing it and even into the next morning, I had like a pink ring around my eye. So this is fantasy. I'm going to swatch that for you so you can see what it looks like on the back of my finger and then on the back of my hand. This one, I would say the consistency, like the texture of it, is a little bit more on the chunkier side. Like you can actually see that it's not as finely milled as the other shadows that I showed you, which is probably why, too, it's also not safe for the eyes. Um, so the Slave to Pink, same thing. As I said, it's not safe for the eyes. And this too is not as finely milled as the rest of the shadows, which I will show you in just a moment. So that is Slave to Pink. And that's it swatched on the back of my hand as well. The next color, which is my number one favorite color out of all of the ones that I purchased, this one is called Game Face. And the finish is Ultra Metallic. So that is its swatch on, the, on my finger. And then on the back of my hand, it looks like so. So it's like a burnt orangish copper color. It's really, really pretty and it looks really, really great. Perfect for just like a wash of color on the lid when you don't want to put anything else on. The last color that I have here, this one doesn't say if it's safe for the eye or not. It just says it's a pressed pigment. And this one is in the color Too Shy. I'm going to swatch that for you to see as well. And this too, I it's like a duochrome finish. I see a lot of pink and purple in it. So this is it swatched on the back of my hand. And that's it right there. So they're very, very pretty. Um, they are, did I mention that it was $5? Yeah, they're $5.00 each so I mean you can't go wrong you get to try them out if you like them you like them if you don't you don't they're only five dollars um, as well when I made, did my order at the time they were getting ready to launch their lip products so I was able to pick two free lip products a lip liner and a lipstick so I also got those and the color that I chose was in the color grind which is a perfect dupe to um, Max lipstick, matte lipstick in heroin. So it looks like that. I'm going to swatch that for you to see as well, right here. So that's it right there. And then I'll also swatch the lip liner for you to see too. And then that's the lip liner. Really gorgeous and fun colors to play around with. Um, I totally recommend you try and ColourPop. I'll leave everything in the description bar below so that you can visit the website. And I just want to thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any video requests, sometimes like 
I'm lost. I don't know what to record. So if you have any specific video quests, requests that you want to see, you can leave them in the comments and I will gladly f fulfill your request. Um, so thanks again for sticking around. Thank you to all my new subscribers. I see you um, as well. If you wanted to know what I had on my lips, they, I have also done a video for that. But in the meantime, it's the Lime Crime Velveteen Lip liquid lipstick and it's in the color Salem it's like a matte brown color as you can see um, I'm really loving the way it feels on my lips so stay tuned for that video I'm not sure if that video will show up first before this one but in either case you can watch them so thanks again for watching and I'll see you soon bye